Hump Day Health. Brought to you courtesy of Gold's Gym. A cancer diagnosis can be terrifying, but for a Wilmington woman, technology made her recovery better than she expected. WWAY's Taylor Yakowenko introduces us to the survivor in this week's Hump Day Health. Well, they call you to come in for a second mammogram, you know, right after the first one. And um, I guess I didn't really react then because I'd had that happen before. For Julie Burton, breast cancer was something she never expected. I didn't have any cancer ever in my family, so it, it was still a total shock when I was there for the biopsy and Dr. Bebb said, well, you have breast cancer. And that is where Dr. Gregory Bebb and the Biosorb come in. It is placed into the cavity that's created when we remove a tumor with what's called a lumpectomy. Dr. Bebb says the spiral-shaped biosorb does several things for a patient. One of them is to make it look better cosmetically. Bebb says the device preserves the space so the body can naturally fill it back in over time after treatment. Plus, the biosorb dissolves in time, too. The second advantage of placing the device is it does allow the radiation doctor, who follows, in most cases, a lumpectomy patient with about a month course of radiation, it allows him to focus his radiation better to where the tumor was actually removed. Bev says in some cases, the device can even reduce the amount of radiation a patient gets. He encourages people to get themselves checked. I still believe in self-breast exam, though that's become a little bit of a point of controversy as well. I would say still a third of my patients are finding their own breast cancers. As for Burton, she's back doing what she loves most, and she says she'll never miss having her annual mammogram. I know there's publicity about uh, the guidelines for having mammography changing, and um, but I certainly would never miss having one every year, and I hope that all the women that I know will also do that. For Hump Day Health, I'm Taylor Yakowenko.